Craig, still unbeaten. Was there a tinge of disappointment today? Um, a little bit. I don't think we did enough over 90 minutes to win a game of football, if I'm being totally honest. I think uh, the last 30 minutes is only when we really got sort of playing um, and played a bit like we can do. So, a bit of sweet. I think we could have easily lost that game and we probably would have done last year. We've got a bit more resilience to us now and uh, any points in this league you're going to be thankful for. Going down to 10 doesn't always benefit the opposition, does it? No, and I felt that. I thought they're a very good defensive team, got some very strong players, and it just made them more resilient. Um, the two centre backs were outstanding for them and really organised them, and uh, they were hard to break down. And we knew that if we didn't sort of play like we can um, and set pieces, they'd punish us, and that's what happened. Typically, as well, when you're chasing it, your two attack minded fullbacks both go down injured. Yeah, I think if I'm. Sounds like you're making an excuse a little bit, but we have come into the game with. Three, four people carrying injuries. Maybe some of them shouldn't have played today. We lost Jake Wright yesterday, so it, it was disruptive. Um, these things happen, and then in the game, we lost both fullbacks, like you said, with groin injuries. So, um, from that point of view, it, it really made us unsettled today. I presume you're looking forward to a week's rest now? Yeah, we need it. Um, it's, like I said, these things happen. Um, it just seems it's happened all at once. Um, I think there's five, six players in there that could have easily not been involved today. So um, we need this week's rest. Hopefully um, by next Thursday we get a few back and uh, nice and fresh for next week. Jordan Theodis got himself on the score sheet again though and stuck his penalty away. Yeah, um, obviously we moved him inside a little bit and he was fantastic, I thought, for the last half an hour. Um, really lively, picking up nice little spaces and um, they're the areas that he does get penalties and goals. And uh, thankful again that he's come up and uh, got the penalty and not only that but scored it. And Dom Knowles got through okay? Yeah, another one that in an ideal world you'd maybe put on bench today because um, physically it was an hard game Tuesday and he's only just come back and I think um, him and a few others maybe looked a bit leggy in the first half but there's only one way to get him match, fat, uh, match fit and sort of get in games and that's what he's done today. A uh, week's rest like we say and then two games over the bank holiday. Is he going to be tested again straight away after that break? Yeah, it's like the same for everybody else. I'm not going to sort of moan about it um, but we, we've just got to get a few more people sort of back 100% fit with no niggles and then uh, attack the, the next week really um, which will be another difficult weekend and Jake Wright could be a while Jordan and Jay are always sus suspended now for three games yeah that's it I mean his first choice from three now is um, not going to be available for the next three matches at least so um, that's disappointing but obviously you move on and other lads have got chances so I'm looking forward to seeing what the rest of the players can do